The ugliest sneaker of all time. I don't know. The ugliest sneaker of all time. I don't know if you if, 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 if your guys will know this, but the the Osiris D3. I didn't know what that is. I know, I know. You it's, know what that is? Sky shoe is horrible. The worst. The worst shoe of all time. And it what's funny is. And they're not skate friendly at all. Not at all. So they're skate shoes. They're literally like. I mean, I keep saying pillow, but they're literally like just these horribly shaped pillow shoes and. At the time, I mean, I don't even know what year they came out. It had to be like, like 98 or so. I don't know, but but they were one of the top selling skate shoes of all time hmm. um, at the time. And they're just literally the most horrendous shoe. No LeBrons, I had a pair of LeBrons. I've never had a pair of Kobe's. I feel like those things get too technical looking for me. Hmm. Like they're just too, like too much going on. I don't, I had a pair of LeBrons, they were cool. I wore them for a little bit, but I never got another pair. They're just, I don't know, to me they just look like shoes for somebody who actually plays basketball, which I couldn't be further from that. So uh, I like to try to simplify as much as possible. No foam posits? No foam posits. I'm not totally against them, uh, but I will say like the toe kind of throws me off a little bit. The way the laces go, they seem to go like real far down on the toe, kind of throws me off a little. I really try to keep it like kind of I have like my favorite Jordans and my, my running shoes and I really like kind of stay in my lane. Fit baby, he saved up a little money and found a connect. He actually made up this whole story about he how he had a friend who had a store who had a connect. And I go upstairs and I'm like, hey, where am I at? And I look and I'm looking on the shelves and I don't see him, but I have so many sneakers, I'm thinking, oh, I must have put them somewhere else. Why do I feel rappers sneakers come and go? I think because they're fans of the consumer. You know, when your fans are the consumer, when your record is hot, they're gonna buy it. When your record is not hot, they're not gonna buy it. 